Cat Michael, eh? You look so good, honey. Oh yeah, and you too. I missed you so much. Don't tell me this is Donald. Yes, mom. Baby, make the woman you've been speaking with on phone for over a year now. The pleasure is all. How are you? Mom, you're not owning me. I'm jealous. See, a lizard in America can never become an alligator in Nigeria. Wallahi, you think because you open the door in overseas, you can't try for Nigeria? Ah, ah. <laughs> Wallahi, this is Nigeria. Wow. Retired General Daniel Singo Kiri. And Dad, yeah. meet your son in law, the man you've always wanted to meet. I see. <laughs> he wouldn't be needing an introduction. That's the lucky man I've been talking with on the phone. Thank you very much, sir. Ah, oh, come on, welcome. <laughs> Thank you, sir. That's good. Yes, sir. Son, welcome, my son. Yes, um, honey. Isn't our son-in-law handsome? Yes, he's as handsome as the smile on the face of a, a victorious platoon commander. <laughs> oh, thank you very much, sir. Thank you very much, sir. Ah! You trust that our daughter here mm -hmm. always go for the best? Yes. yes. I am sure this is going to be the wedding between Miss Beauty and Mr. Charming. Oh yeah, you can yes. say that again, Mom. Hey, yeah, baby. Baby, welcome to my family. Oh, once again, it's my pleasure to be here. Lizzie. Yes, Dad. Come on, take him upstairs. The fresh enough. He deserves to be treated as a prince in the palace, mm -hmm. not as a buffalo soldier in the barracks. Yes, General. But Dad. You just have to come to reality that you have been retired for over 15 years. And the military terms must retire too, you know. Oh, come on, come on, come on. You can take the soldier out of the barracks, but you can never take the barracks out of the soldier. A soldier, a general is a general. <laughs> come on, son. Yeah, welcome. Thank you very much. Yes, thank you. Come on, take him out. All right, guys. Okay, thank you, sweetie. Thank you. Yes. Ah, yes. 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 Happy is the word. I am so happy. Our daughter made a very good choice. Oh, yes. Welcome home, my love. Uh, it's so good to be here, you know. I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I'm glad that I made it down here. Yes, I'm happy too. Um, baby, you have to remain here till after the wedding in two weeks' time. But I thought we agreed that. I'm going to spend just two nights here and then I move back to the hotel. So what you're trying to say is that my father's house is not big enough for you, it's not comfortable. No, I, I know, I know. 
I never said that. Okay, but we had an agreement, and an agreement is an agreement. Okay. Okay, whatever. You know your wish is my command. I thought you love you so much. <laughs> Sweetheart, forever is an understatement. I will love you till life and death. Oh. <laughs> Let's get it. Mom. Why are you crying? Mom? You told me we are coming to Grandpa's house. Is this not the right place? My daughter. This is the right place. <laughs> but I'm afraid. Afraid? I'm afraid. Let's pray. In Jesus' name. Amen. Father, oh Lord, anything that is making my mommy afraid, Father, oh Lord, let her not be afraid in Jesus' name. Donald, I hope you're enjoying the meal. Oh, great, Mom. Never had it better. Thank you very much. <laughs> My mom got her cookbook from heaven. Now I know where you got your cookies goes from. <laughs> yeah, that reminds me. Lunard, you know, father called in the morning. It has get my mind to ask him when they will be coming home for their marriage. Oh, okay, uh, my parents should be arriving in a few days to the wedding. Um, Dad, Donald will be checking in at the hotel tomorrow. What for? Which hotel is more comfortable and secure than the fortress of the general? Son, you will stay here where you are. Security is guaranteed. Right? Yes, yeah, 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 thank you very much. Sir. Eat. You're right. <laughs> um, my parents, my parents, are they going to um, come here when we're still going to the village for the traditional marriage, right? Are they still going to come? Mama, you do not expect a general of my caliber to bow to such traditional mumbo jumbo. So you don't, you don't have to. Especially when it concerns the marriage of my daughter. So everything happens here. At my will. Beat. <laughs> Your father has not changed. He still flaunts his military stature in whatever he does. We've planned both the traditional and the white wedding here in this town. That's okay. That, that saves us uh, the stress of traveling. Um, you know, to and fro to the village and then back. Um, thank you very much, General. Honey. Okay, sir. Hope ours isn't going to be a military wedding. Sure, sir. Sanusi, what is it? Um, sorry for the interruption, Oga. Um, Oga, there is a woman and a small daughter. Crying, the beginner crying <laughs> outside the gate. Kumade, as a better person, when I went to ask, I said, Madam, 
What thing be the problem? What is it? no see. Yes, Olga. Straight to the point. Yo, wow. I understand. You see, Olga, the woman said I want to see general. You want to see general? I say, yeah. Now you want to see Olga? You want to see general? Ha! I say, I will come tell me, Olga. Did you ask her who she is? Yeah. Did you ask her who she is, Sanusi? Uh, honey, uh, I think it could be one of these corporate beggars. You know, this uh, economic recession and all that. So, it could be one of them. Are you sure this is the right place? Jenny, yes, this is the right place. But like I told you earlier, I'm afraid. Oh. You have not told me why you are afraid. Like I told you earlier, I'm scared. This is the first time I'm bringing you here. I just prayed to work. I prayed to work out. Hey, fine, fine, babies. <laughs> um, Oga I give you this morning. And come day, I have added my phone number inside. Kingare, I understand. I, I don't want your money. I need to see him face to face. <laughs> face to face. You won't go see your guy face to face. We are looking. Me and the chief security officer. Now give you money. Now add my phone number inside. Kumare, now call me fine fine babies. You won't go see your guy with madam pa. Madam na den saibo. No? <laughs> okay, no problem. Let's get there. Make we see. We are going inside. Let's go, let's go. See Oga now, let's go. Bye, bye, bye. Who's Mom, Dad, I'm sorry. Please find it in your heart to forgive me. I regret my mistakes of the past. Please. Take me back into your home. For the sake of my... My daughter, yeah, your granddaughter. Her name is Jenny. I remain General Danielson Okiri. Retired but not tired of the military in me, which disowned you eight years ago. My discipline is my arsenal that can never be penetrated by time or circumstances. Remove yourself and your bastard daughter from my home, from my house this moment. Mom, please. Please help me beg further. Please. I am sorry. Please forgive me. I'm sorry! Go and find the father of your child and find
formally present him to me as your husband to be. I am not going to let you turn my house into the barracks of bastards. I have searched everywhere for him. But he's nowhere to be found. I have learned from my mistake. Please, forgive me. I, I have had a very terrible experience living out there without the, the blessings of my parents. Forgive me. I have suffered as a single mother. Father, please have mercy. Have mercy. So, there's no cause to panic. Her body needs a lot of sleep to regain consciousness. Thank you, doctor. Also, sir, her body requires constant checkup for full restoration of her health. Well, that's all right. You are the doctor, aren't you? Uh, sir, uh, if I may ask, what really happened? Why, why is her body... Uh, blood pressure so high. Mm. She had an encounter with uh, my daughter, I mean my ex-daughter. A girl I disowned some eight years back. That's uh, it. I, I, I don't understand, sir. <laughs> Do you have another daughter apart from the one I know? Come on, doctor. You really want me to start discussing my family affairs here? Do you? Do you? Anyway. I disowned her. That's for good. There is no going back. Yes. I don't ever go back. Forward. Forward. No going back. Yes. Now, doctor. I want you to concentrate on this woman. She is my wife. You are my personal doctor, my personal physician, and you know we are close. My house is always open for you, 24 hours a day, right? So please, I beg you, take care of this woman, my wife. Her health is important to me. In fact, her health is more important then Somalia Peace Mission. Go and get it right. Did you hear me? Yes, sir. That's right. That face looks familiar. That girl is so exact in my memory. I have met her somewhere before. I just can't place my mind on a particular place I met her. Yes. Oh no. I just can't remember. Just can't remember nothing. Look at this. Something I never wanted to remember again. That's something you never wanted to remember. And you did not make 
Benita is my elder sister, and it is just the two of us. My father decided not to have another child since my mother passed through cesarean session. He raised us with iron hands, with love, support, care and everything. We never lacked anything. But unfortunately for Benny, she got pregnant in her final year while in secondary school. Daddy got so angry and disowned her. Families and friends waited in on the matter. But my father is renowned and never turning back on his decisions. Even though lives are thick. So you mean your father disowned her just because she she got pregnant? Honey, I've told you before. My father is a full-blooded, no-nonsense army general. So what do you think will happen when he finds out that you are already pregnant for me? Please, do not mention this ever again. At least not even in this house. If he hears that, we are both dead. And that is why I want us to rush this marriage and return to the States. His face looks familiar. I have met him somewhere before. Could he be somebody I know? He seems to have met me before too. That look in his eyes is suspicious. I am sure I have seen that face before. Not just that face. His face rings a bell in my heart. I don't ever want to see you in or around this place ever again. This garrison is off limits to both you and your bastard of a daughter. Now get out, get lost, move. Father, please. please. Please, I am sorry. Please, I'm sorry. Please, please forgive me. Please, forgive me, Father. Please. please forgive, us. forgive us, please. Please, yes. Forgive us. I see. So you want to see how brutal a general can be. Wait for it. 
Useless girl, cross into this territory and you cross into a crossfire of counter attack. Sanusi! Yes, Oga! Okwaret, sir! If I see this kind of a thing again, you face the firing squad! Okwaret, Oga! Scatter your nyash! <laughs> Don't try that way. Next. Left side. Over. We heard a gunshot outside the gate. Is everything all right? Whenever a gunshot is heard within the territorial range of a war general, there is no cause for alarm. I am in charge. Oh, okay, fine now. Um, are you all right, ma'am? Um, she will... She needs a little more care. And uh, the family doctor will be coming to look in on her regularly. Okay, sir. Come on. Just take it, easy, okay? Just take it slow, man. Huh? Slow, man. My husband, please, I beg you. Let's allow her in. It's obvious she has suffered so much. Please, show her some mess, okay? What you ask is impossible. Even if you don't want to allow her in, let's alleviate her suffering. She looks so helpless and fast running out of life. Cool. I have never changed my decisions since I became a three-star general. Let her help herself by providing the father of her child. Funny, I'm a mother. No matter the rank of the military officer I'm married to. Enough. You know how dangerous it is to climb me further than this. Leave me now.
forgive my mommy, please. Please. I have sorry my mommy, please. Grandpa. Grandpa. Grandpa, please. I am tired of suffering. Grandpa. Jenny! Jenny! Jenny, what are you doing here? Let's go! What are you doing here? Let's go! My father is a very brutal man. He when he's angry. Come, let's go! I don't want him to meet us here! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! out from this house. No one let that baby cry. Let her cry until her father comes from wherever he's hiding. But dad, for the sake of the little child. Hey, no one word from you. No more. Oh, doctor. Uh, Welcome. Good day, sir. Please proceed on your medical check. Doctor. Do not. Do not. <laughs> Do not. Do not. Do not. Do not. Very good to see you, man. Thank you. Um, 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 I'm so, so sorry. Um, you see, uh, Do not and I were cosmates, and um, we were staying together in the same hostel before I left for the States. Man, I would have been here. Private doctor, Dr. Donatus. Oh, the world is indeed a global territory with so many war fronts where you do not make mistakes with your bullets. <laughs> so, what are you doing here? Yeah, actually, I and Lizzie are getting married, and um, you know, we just came back from the States. Oh, 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 oh. So, so you are the, the luckiest man. No, 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 no. Oh, oh the lucky dude. Well, <laughs> oh, what a day. The family continues. Yes. <laughs> After both of you have gone away from your barracks of friendship, you find yourself reuniting under the residential cantonment of General Danielson. Okay, retired. Oh. Yes. <laughs> Congratulations, young man. Thank you very much. You're right, Dad. You're right. <laughs> Do that. Yeah. So good to see you, man. So good, you know. Wow. All right. Doctor, proceed. Move. I saw it too, but I'm not sure. I'm still confused. But what? Thank God you're here. So why are you confused? Oh, I, 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 I was, can we just go back inside? Baby? Let's go inside before they suspect something. Right? All is not well. Yes, all is not well, but you should understand that the walls have ears. Everything is listening. Come on, let's go inside.
You know what? When you send out a platoon on a reconnaissance mission, that's an Iraqi, they come back to give a report. That is, they break down what they found behind the enemy line. So, break it down for the general. Oh, the situation that troubles our mind should be ameliorated as quick as possible. Or better still, you can still ask her what she wants. So we know where to start. What she wants is not an option here. So you better suggest something else. I'm not going to admit that girl back into my house unless she provides the father of that her child. I'm not going to relax. Garrison discipline at this point. General, even when your life, your wife's life is at stake here. So, court martial continues unabated. I'm not going to pardon her. Pardoning her is out of the question. Then in that case, I will suggest you, you make use of the carrot and stick formula, General Sir. <laughs> All right, fall out. Kate! All work, sir. Jenny, let's go. Let's go. Jenny, let's go. this house. She will help you wash all the cars, sweep the compound, and generally assist you in every way possible in your chores. Do I make myself clear? Yes, sir. All correct, sir. <laughs> but, Oga, <laughs> you know, see, I will be a tough person. Who, no? Will she also be sleeping in my room? Um, I mean, um, will she be my bedroom assistant? Sanusi! Yes, Oga! One leg. Up! <laughs> Go on! Sorry, sir! Yes, Oga! <laughs> oh, yeah, oh, yeah, wait, wait, wait. Yeah, sorry. She will be sleeping. There. At the gatehouse. No. And you must ensure that she remains a mate and nothing but a mate. Honey. <laughs> Sanusi! Hey, yes, Oga! Yes, Oga! Up! Hey, hey Laila! <laughs> Sorry, oh, please. Adwaya! <laughs> Yawa! Thank you, Mr. Honey. No buts. We have an agreement, don't we? Sanusi! Uh, yes, yes, sir. Yes, Oga. Take over. Yes, sir. Oh, all right, sir. <clears throat> you see, I will make sure I do all my jobs very well on her. <laughs> you are, Kumade, what Oga has done to get us. Must remain. Yes, sir. All correct, sir. The gate. Correct, Oga. Take over. Yeah. <laughs> How about my job, Grandpa?
You will be the two I see to your mother maid. Is that understood? Yes. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Good. Have you seen what you've done to yourself? <laughs> Have you seen it? I am very sure she's the one. But how long do I approach this matter now? For how long will I keep this secret away from the same family that entrusted me with their lives? I am trapped between the devil and the Red Sea. And the worst of it all is that Donald is not even ready to let anything out about this matter. No. No. I must do something before it's too late. I must do something. I can't afford to keep this secret now that I have the chance to let it out. Why haven't I been able to, to rest or even to sleep ever since I set my eyes on that girl? I hope what I am feeling don't turn out to be true. just have to go from wherever it came from. I just have to try. Try so hard to subdue it. Ahem. Listen and listen very carefully. Rules number one. No flower must be taller than the other. Must be agement, the same agement. Equal. I understand. I understand. <laughs> you see, now because I've a tough person, you know, I know what I'm saying. Why you follow me? Now, what is this? I said, what can be this? Fine. I said, what can be this? It's fine. Can't share your number over. They will lie. No sense at all. No sense. See, this one is called uh, worse. What do I call him? I say worse. What I say worse? Worse. Worse. You are worried. <laughs> now, now you are talking. You are, you are going to make sure that you clean the whole uh, motto. See, Madame Car, the Oga. Now, everybody for this compound, killing the world cast, killing! You understand? You understand? You understand. Yeah, wow, correct. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Um, this way. Follow me. Um, yeah, child. Ah, uh, yes, everything, everything. Yeah. 
Amen. I hope you guys are going to turn up. Yeah, the wedding is for They are into it. <laughs> no, no, that's the kind of wedding. You know, this that's, that's Africa. As a way with our own weddings, right? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. <coughs> come on, come on. You see this place? Like, like. So follow me. You see this place? Now what is this place called? Huh? I said what thing did they call this place? Yeah. Garden. No? You say anything? It's called a garden. See, you see garden egg for ya? No? You see garden egg for ya? See, make I tell me. This place is called Peel. It's called Peel. Peel. No be football field though. Na oga. Some of them Peel. Understand? Yeah, why? Yeah, why? Kwade. And at the end of the month, now you go bring a machine, give me. You go use them, clean everywhere. You go do. You understand? You understand. Yeah, wow, correct. <laughs> you know, say me I'm a tough person. I am a tough person. Thank you very well. Good advice. Later. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Baby. Are you alright? Yes, ma'am. I'm fine. Mom. Yeah. Why would that do a thing like that? Reducing his own daughter to a common maid in her own father's house. Sweetheart, we should even be happy that he allowed her into this house. You know who your father is? Then you should have just let the forgiveness be whole. <laughs> Did I hear you say forgiveness? As far as your father, General Denison Okiri, retired, is concerned, there is absolutely nothing like forgiveness in his dictionary. So you better wake up. But even allowed her into this house was because of my health. I had to ally with the doctor to make him do that. What? Yes. Dad is really taking this to the extreme. Mom, for goodness sake, eight years, as in eight solid years of rejection, is enough punishment. I think I will just have to talk to him. Hey, hey, hey. Please, please. I can't afford to have this wedding cancelled. Wake up from your dream, girl. You know how impossible it is for your father to change his mind. Please, for the sake of your forthcoming wedding, do not even attempt a thing like that. Your father, retired General Danielson Okiri, is difficult.
Hi, baby. You and I know that dad doesn't intend treating you this way. But for the irremediable military blood in him, come to think of it, do you mean you haven't set eyes on this guy till now? Or is it denying his responsibility? I can't even recognize him when I see him. <sighs> Never known him. I only met him at a party. How is that even possible? That you can't recognize the man who got you pregnant? Or do you even know his name? I know they call him Tom. He was popularly called Tom at the party. Don, Don. That must be his nickname. What about his, his name? As in his real name? His real name is Don. Don. What are you doing with that maid? Good, good, good money, Dad. Did I not want you to stay clear of her? Did I not? Uh, 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 Shut up! Shut up your mouth! All you owe her in this house is order. Order! Order her! Order and order! Nothing more than order! What did I say? Order! She is your maid. Is that clear? Good. But, but that she's still my... One more word from you. Now we have you sent to the guard room and blazoned and frog jumped. Nonsense. If you find any of you having anything to do with her, anything to do with her, I'm going to send her parking. Is that clear? Yes, is that, yes. Now get out. Get out, out. Go on, move. Run. That's better. Hey, look at that. I give you the best upbringing as a father. That you chose you chose to smear my rank in the mud. I will never forgive you. I will never ever forgive you unless you bring whoever. Whoever is the father of that bastard and introduce him to me as your husband to be. Do you understand? So why did you take that risk? Why? I thought your father warned you. He warned you to stay clear. To stay clear completely. I'm sorry baby, I couldn't help it. No, she's my only sister. You couldn't help it. I have stayed in this house just for a few days. But I can predict your father. Your father is a no-nonsense man. A man of his words. So you cannot tell me that you love your sister more than your parents. They give back to her. If they can stay clear, then you should do the same. 
Sorry, baby. I'll, I'll try not to get too close next time. Good. So, so that you just have to try, okay? Just try and stay clear. And let's get our wedding done. Get everything perfectly well. And then we return to the States. Come back in one piece. Alright? You promise not to do that anymore. Thanks, baby, for the care. And I love you so much. Oh. I love you too. That is how much one means to each other. Right? I love you too. Benita. Benita, I, I, I am sorry. You are sorry? Sorry about what? I, I am sorry for everything. What are you talking about? Down before you. I'm talking to you now. I come on to the canal, and they kill him now. I'm asking you now. Was with you people in Somalia for the peacekeeping stuff. I don't know. Forgotten his name. That's Mimika Sa. M I M I K. Mimika Sa. T S A V. Sa. T S A V. Okay, thanks. Hi, Mom. Hi, Dad. Good evening, man. And how are you doing now? I'm great, thanks. This one? I don't know why idle civilians will give military disobedience to simple medical instructions. She will get better. Of course I will. If you base her doctor. So, where are both of you off, off to? Um, Dad, we're going for a photo session. And after that, um, we will see the girls selected for the bridal train. I see. All right. The driver will take you. 
drive it to wherever you want, but ensure that you come back in time. Right? Come on. Off you go. Bye, Bye. 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 Off you go. Bye. 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 Go, 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 go. Be careful. Yeah. yeah. Right. Sorry, darling. This is your friend in army headquarters, Abuja. I don't know. What's that his name? That's enough. Woman, the doctor gave you clear instructions. Off you go. Retire. Go on. Yes, sir. Good. Okay. Good day, Uncle. Good day, Auntie. How are you? Fine. Uncle, can I ask you for a favor? Oh, yeah, go ahead. I like the way you and Lizzie used to behave to each other. My mom said I don't have a daddy. Uncle, please don't be offended. Please, can you bring one of your friends to always play with my mommy? Like the way your aunt Lizzie used to play with each other, so she can be happy. Okay, sweetie. Don't worry. God will provide a friend for your mommy like my husband, okay? Tony, um, you see, with God, all things are possible. And definitely God is going to bring a man that will bring happiness to your mother. Thank you for your kindness, auntie. Um, Jenny. Um, Jenny, did your mommy tell you you don't have a daddy? My mom said my daddy stays very far away. She promised me that I'll see him one day. <laughs> You're going to see your daddy someday. You're definitely going to see him someday, okay? Eh? okay? God is going to make it possible for you. Okay. Alright, give me that. Ten. Ten. Okay. Take it. Alright, come on, Joe. Come on, Joe. Look, ten, and you. Oh, God. Bye. Bye.
Just wondering, I are you giving any thought to what we're going to present to our daughter and her husband on their wedding day? Oh, um, not really. A lot of things are going on in my mind, but I'm I'm here to settle for you. Mm. Mm. I want something wonderful. Mm -hmm. I want something that's going to rake up the envy of that our wayward daughter and make her go frantically in search of that animal that got her pregnant. The animal that got her pregnant. <sighs> in that case, how about a house and a car? Mm-hmm. Not bad. Okay. Not bad. But uh, I want something they, that they will have to take back with them to America after the wedding. Okay. Yes. <clears throat> okay. As a matter of fact, I have started processing their travel documents on, mm. for a two-week honeymoon to Hong Kong. Hmm. The Netherlands hmm? and uh, Disneyland. Wow! <laughs> Honey, that, that's a great one. Mm. Just give me time. Let me think of something, okay? Hmm? Rack your hmm. brain. Rack your brain. I will. <laughs> I will. <laughs> Alright. Alright, fall out. Okay. Yes, sir! Yezum. What? Yezum. Yezum. And then next time you do it with your right hand, not with, not with the left. Okay. Yes, yeah, Better. <laughs> Bye, honey. <laughs> yeah.
Don, I don't know how to go about this. What if what I am suspecting eventually turns out to be true? And uh, if what you are suspecting is true, that means there's a problem here. By the way, I thought you came with Lizzie. Where is she? Um, yes, I did. We came together. She's at a seamstress shop. You know, taking measurement for the bridal train. Done. <laughs> we are talking about the family of a brutal general. Retired. But not tired of doing the worst. That is what you are thinking or what we are thinking is true. And that is why I'm asking you to get this job done for me. That is why I want you done. I want you to do this job for me. What job are you talking about? Help me find out if that little girl is truly my child. That's the job I want you to do. That's what I want you to do for me as a friend. Is anything the matter? Are you okay? Oh yeah. Oh. What are you doing? My parents are not home. What of the security man? He has gone to get the zeal. You should have called before coming. Actually, uh, it, it's you I came to see. Me? I'm sorry, I'm not allowed to talk to anyone. Please. Mm. Look. Look, Benita. Honestly, just... I made well for you. Just allow me to explain the reason why I'm here. I have never loved anyone the way I loved you. It's been my biggest aspiration to marry from this family. Please, I beg of you, please. Hello, doctor. Yeah, um... What's, what's happened? Oh, sir, I, I had a little problem with the car from under. I'm trying to fix it. Oh, sorry about that. Why don't you use the mechanic? Oh, I, I will do that as soon as I leave here. Open the gate! <coughs> to take good care of me. Of course. <laughs> Thank you very much. Of course. What's this? Um, I'm sorry. Okay. Uh, um, just a piece of paper um, that was used in um, protect the inner layer of the shoe. Okay, give me that. Let me trash it for you. Huh? Let me trash it for you. Okay. Uh, no longer I wore this. This shoe. You have a package. A package? Yes. From who? The postman just brought it now. Drop it on the table. Okay. Ma. 
Yes. I want to ask you something. Please don't be offended. Okay, what is it? Are you my grandmother? Lizzie and Donald will be getting married in a few days' time. Oh, uh -huh. <laughs> you are Donald. Uh, yes, I am Donald. Her name is Benita. She's my sister, as well as you, sister in law. And this is our adorable little beautiful daughter, Jenny. This wedding is going to be the most glamorous wedding ever. Oh yeah? Trust your father. <laughs> He's going to break his treasure box to make sure that this wedding is <clears throat> unique. <laughs> well, that has always been his heart's desire for his children. Mm -hmm. And I pray I make that come to reality in my own part someday. Oh. I am you having your wedding with my daddy. Very soon, sweetie. And on that day, you're going to be one of the bride of train. Yes. Dressed so beautifully and gorgeously. Wouldn't you, sweetie? <laughs> <laughs> See, Benny, I know how you feel. I totally understand your pain. You know, all this is really getting out of control. But why don't you just arrange with some guy out there, just any guy to settle down with, instead of going through this torture every single day? I can help you arrange for one if you don't mind. I don't want any other man. I want Jenny's father. And I know I would look at him someday. And do you keep going through this pain every day? Like every time? Is that what you want for yourself? I have waited for the past eight years. I may not have to wait for one more month to look at him. Wow. He seems so confident. I wish you the best, sister. And I hope when you eventually set eyes on this mysterious man, he won't delay your marriage. I know I will find him. And when I find him, I will marry him, even if he's engaged to someone else. Yes, good one. 
I support you on this one. And you always have my back, okay? Thank you. Thank you so much. I'm so moved by the heart of your mother. I, I forgot the consequence of my actions. Please forgive me. I need to be left alone now. Please. It, it won't happen again, I promise. I, I won't be moved by such dangerous sympathy again. Please. Please help me. It's too late. Nothing, girl, must leave my house now. Will you please, please, honey, please, I, I beg you. It was all my fault. I forced her to dine with me. I did. Why did you do that? Why did you do that? It was because of your health condition that I limited the number of children to two. It was because they are girls that I decided to raise them equal to men. I gave them all and more than they ever wanted. Put them in the best of schools. I gave them all. More than what they want. I gave them all. I retired from the army. Before my time. In order to give them uninterrupted father's attention. I committed both wealth and time to build a formidable garrison around their dreams and aspirations. But in the end, my giant and elephant sacrifice was given squirrel Ovation by that idiot. The pride of one General Oakley was smeared in the mud of shame. Stay here and ask for my forgiveness. I will forgive only at the bottom of my six feet grave. Leave my presence now. Donatus, please help me out of this. Please just make this work for me. Don, I mean, I have not had rest. I have not had rest, especially after getting that, that note from her. Tom, don't you think I'm risking my job as a family physician by getting myself involved into this? What are you talking about, man? What are you talking about? Huh? We've done more, more dangerous things than this. What is this? Hey, we've done so many things, we've done dangerous things more than this. Just help me get this one done, that's it. Donald. There is nothing more dangerous of fixing the wrath of General Denison Okiri himself. Look, 
This is a man who has conquered the high and mighty in the society. A man who could even disown his own daughter for years and still remaining clinching to that decision. All I'm asking is for you to be a mediator. Okay? Be a mediator between me and Benita. That's it. Before I stick my head out. That's all I'm saying. Come on, what are friends for? My good friend Donatus, help me get this one done. Okay? No. Just, just, just find out no. if truly that child is mine. Okay. Okay, okay. How are you? Fine. Thank you. Cheers. It is high time I approached him instead of dying in silence. For how long will I continue like this? I am very sure he is the one. But why has he refused to talk to me or even share my pain? How can men be this wicked? For how long will I continue dying in silence? No, I have to approach him before it becomes too late. Mom, why are you not eating? I am not famished. Why? My daughter. I'll eat later. Have I not warned you to stay clear of my family? What gave you the animal boldness to stand before my reputable son-in-law? Useless whore. Are you out of your mind? Sir, I, I, actually, she brought my, my missing phone to me. Oh, yes. You lost your phone? Yes, yes, sir. And um, she found it under the car and uh, brought it back to me. See, that's it. That's all. And what are you still standing there waiting? What are you waiting for? Useless thief. What are you still doing here? I'm, I'm sorry, sir. Thank you very much, sir. She's actually the one that's supposed to be sorry for herself. Yes, she is. Until I get the animal that impregnated my daughter. Impregnated the daughter of General Danielson Okiri. And get him quartered. Get him slashed. Dragooned. Torn apart. Court martialed. Given bunny bunny. She remains an outcast. Okay, sir. Did you hear that? Yes, sir. Good. Yes, sir. Sit down. 
Sit down. That's good. Yes. Man needs a true love. Look, darling. Every woman needs a man that can value her more than life itself. Every woman needs peace of mind and security. Look, I am here to tell you that you are, you are the luckiest woman the world has ever seen. I love you beyond words. I love you more than you love yourself. Look, darling, a little space in your heart will mean the whole world to me. Please bless my soul, and I'll forever make you my goddess. You shut up. Are you blind? Don't you know the truth? The only truth I know is that you are my bread. Without you, I'm, I am just as dead as grave. Making you my wife is the only thing that can resurrect my soul from the grave and pains I have suffered all these years. Please, bless my life. Don't you dare kneel down there to pretend like you don't know the secret. You men are heartless. Yeah. Oh, you're Baju. Baju also. <laughs> yeah. So are you still coming with your wife? Or she went to Cameroon? Oh, she's coming back with her. Okay, stop. You heard me right. I don't understand. What don't you understand? The meaning or spelling of secrets. I still do not understand. Go ask your friend. He knows my sister's secrets. If you are his best friend, then you must know his best kept secrets. You find out that the child is true, my child. I never wanted to get myself involved into this. At the first place, but you pushed me to it. Do you know how precious this family is to me? Do you, do you know what I'm about to lose here? What are you about to lose? Huh? Come on, man, don't talk about sack because nobody's going to sack you. Okay? I already talked to Lizzie and she's not going to say anything. And she might sue me here anytime soon. She's not going to say anything. And no other year should hear this. Alright? I probably have her own secrets as well. What secret are you talking about? She's four months gone. Look, 
The general must not hear this. And that is why we're rushing this wedding. I fear that man. I see him as a devil himself. So all I want you to do is to rush up and find out if that girl is truly my child. That's what I want to know. I, I, I don't understand. Are you planning on getting married to two sisters? Well, I, I, I don't care. I just don't want to go back to that idiot. You know, this is the way she insulted me all just because of you. Look, over my dead body, will I go back to her? I, I know. Let, let's just go back, okay? But you can just smile. Smile. I mean, smile. <laughs> Here, let's go. Smile. The very thought of you this morning brought tears to my eyes. I will never forgive you for the shame you brought to my home. Since you have chosen not to speak by democracy, I will have you speak by the whip of aristocracy. When you are truly tired, you will tell me the father of that bastard. You have only done one hour and you're tired. Do you know how many months I spent at the Battle of Somalia dodging bullets, bombs, and grenades just to earn the rank of a Lieutenant Colonel? Do you know how many years of constant battle with rebels it took me to surmount the civil war in Rwanda? just to earn the rank of a brigadier general. Do you know how long I commanded the multinational battalion across the desert to conquer the massacre in Liberia? I paid dearly for the rank you've chosen to smear in the mud of shame for eight years for eight years you've carried the burden of a bastard and the cross of a useless man yet you're not tired of hiding the truth about the animal that got you pregnant it is too late for mercy my dear victim. Sanusi, go on. Move it, move it, move it, move it, move it. Oh, what is over? What happened to you? Pull up, jump, pull up, jump, pull up, jump. Pull up, jump. Move it. Yell for mercy. Yeah. <laughs> 
more bunny bunny. for forgiveness. Dad, I'm very sure that she's regretting her mistake by now. Please, Daddy, have mercy. It's too late to bend my discipline. The only atonement for the tears of a soldier is blood. But Dad, she is your flesh and blood. Your own biological daughter. Dad, she still has your blood flowing through her veins. Daddy, please. I was already a general before I had both of you. If truly she is my daughter, then she is a soldier by birth. Soldiers are given to court martial. Whenever they break military discipline, military rule has its capital mutiny. But daddy. This is a social matter and not the barracks. I am a general. And the house of a general is like a social barracks. Now enough, enough of all this. I'm fast running out of patience. Come on, leave me. Move. I do wrong that you're not telling me. Why are you hurting me this much? You're not picking my calls or returning them either. Like you used to do. What did I do? Please tell me. Look, Abigail, I, I want to be left alone. Baby, we used to do everything together. And I cherish it so much. What is the problem? I said I want to be left alone. My love. Maybe you can't just end a relationship of five years just like that. Remember, we've been the envy of all. Maybe what would the world say? Please, I'm sorry. 
I can take care of myself. No. Please. Please. Please, baby, don't. Please take me. Agreed on some. No, no uh, uh, th this is a different case. I am not asking you to go and plead on my behalf. Yes, I, I, I wanted you to bring the drugs for a treatment. After the punishment she got from uh, 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 um, the general, I just wanted you to help treat her. No, that is it. That is exactly my problem here. I don't want to come close to that girl. Look, I stand the risk of losing my job and facing the general's wrath. But I'm just begging you just to do this for the last time. For just this, this last time. Eh? Just do it for me for all time's sake. Don't please. Okay, okay, okay. Look, Dona. Why don't you just go out there? Buy this drug yourself. Then give it to her yourself. No, 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 no. I can't. I can't. She has want me to stay away from her. That should stay clear. I shouldn't come close. She threatened me in letters. Also threatened to stab me if I come close to her again. Why don't you just forget about this girl and move on with your marriage, which is coming in less than six days from now? I think you're right. I think you have a point there. Since she has refused to talk anything about it or to say anything about it, I think I should just let her be and face what I'm meant to face. Exactly. Action. Just have to remain like this. Let her go to hell. Let her do whatever she wants to do. Exactly. What? Huh? I've been begging her, trying to talk to her. Who is she? Does she want something to follow me? I am sorry for the torture yesterday. I have brought this drug for you. Please permit me to treat you. Thank you. I don't want your treatment. I know you don't want me to treat you, but you need it. Someone has been sending you to me. Oh. Is that not? No, 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 no. True love has sent me to you. Powerful feelings that I cannot resist has sent me to you. Look, I, I have never loved a woman like this before. The thought of you brightens my day. Your face has dominated the stars of the night. Even when I close my eyes, you flow into me like the fresh breath of life. Please, allow me to be your love doctor.
what are you doing here? I said, what are you doing here? What does it look like I'm doing? I am massaging my body. Oh, massaging. <laughs> you know, say me, I'm a better person. I said, better person. Why well, are sorry? <laughs> fine, fine babies. Yeah. Come on, come on from here. I said, get out of here. Move. I will make I move me. Eight years of hiding landed you in my house. And your eight years of running has landed you in my hands. You can see the horrible condition your one minute Sedra urge has kept me for the past eight years. Baby, can you just Don't calm down? tell me to calm down. Please just calm down. And now you're here to show your wild oats with my own sister. to examine that dream because I will not let it come to pass. Just calm down. I'm next. Don't tell me. Shh. Calm down. I'll tell you everything. I'll tell you everything. Everything that you need to know. I promise to tell you. I cross my heart. It's a promise. I will keep. Really? Yes. Now go on explain. I'm listening. What do you have to say? I promise. I promise. I can handle this situation. Okay? I want you to believe me. I can handle it. Please. Believe me, I can do it. Right? This is a family that I love so much. And, and I will do everything, everything possible to uphold the, the, the unity of this house. Good, Simon. But that won't change my stand. The deed has already been done. And you must finish it. Exactly there is only one way out. That is exactly what I am saying. That's exactly what I want you to understand. And I am going to make sure that I see to the end of your suffering. It's a promise. sleeping the compound? No, sir. Why are you sleeping? Eh? Why are you sleeping in the barrack? I slept late last night. Look at it and walk on. Look at I, I, I slept late last night. I sleep. See, make I tell you me. Kingane, 
this place is a barrack. I understand? So no sleeping is allowed. No sleeping is allowed in the barrack. You understand? You understand? We well, continue sweeping. Continue sweeping, Akache. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Continue sweeping. Check your way. Laziness. Lazy bamboo. Okay, sweep now. Okay, Where I sweep this side? Where I look at? Sweep. Sweep, Akache. Of all people. <laughs> Maybe for the past two weeks. Two weeks now, my whole world is crumbling before my own eyes. <laughs> but babe, don't check very well. Are you sure you've not done anything suspicious that he may have found out? I can't remember. Donatus is the only man that I, I know is responsible and different from other men. He is loving, caring. I can't even go a day without checking on you. And that is how we have been for the past five years. Of course, everybody knows that. But what I don't understand is waking up one morning and change his mind. Think very well. Think. Think deep. It, it, it will help you out. I think I remembered something. It was only a mistake. Waste no time to confess to him. It may solve the whole problem. I'm tired of seeing you sharing tears every day. Hotel for rooms reservation. I am worried about my grandmother. That poor girl is suffering for what she knows nothing about. Focus our attention on our daughter Benita. How about that? Say it. I said it. I said I never wanted that girl here in the first place. Honey, can you be honest to me? Are you glad about that girl's condition? That is certainly not the best way to correct the mistakes that we made already. All right. So let's have it this way. Both of them stay out. They leave this house. And they stay out until she provides the man who got her pregnant. How about that? How about that? Whatever. What did you just say? 
what did I just hear you say? Oh, that's better. Insurrection and mutiny in the army must be put down and dealt with decisively. Whatsoever. Knock off my bones before you little idiots open the gate. Auntie, I'm sorry. My mommy is washing at the backyard. Uncle Sanusi is, is helping the electricians to wire the water home. And what do I care about what your stupid mother and Sanusi are doing? Huh? What do I care? Auntie, I'm sorry. Sorry for your little self. And to see your earring. And what are you supposed to do? Pick it up! Okay. Like your mother can afford it. Nonsense. Give it for you, fit. She finally spoke to you after all the threats. Did you find out if the child is yours? Yes. The child is mine. I met uh, I met Benita at um, a birthday party, and I did all I could, all I could to make her my friend. And at last we became friends. She has never taken alcohol before. She don't even taste it. But I had to make her take it. She was kind of tipsy and she asked me to take her to her hostel. Instead, I took her to my room, my house. And behold, she was a virgin. I took advantage of, of her and... Um, she ran out of my house. And I never get to see her again. Before I left for the States, I did all I could and I prayed to God to see her for just one more time. But I never did. Not until now. <laughs> I saw her again. And this time she, she has a child, my own child. To tell me the matters. What do I do? And I am getting married to her sister. And look at she already has a beautiful child for me. I love Benita so much. Seeing her again has rekindled my love for her. I so much love her. This is serious. Then uh, you must cancel the wedding before it's too late. Liz is already four months gone. Oh, my goodness. Honestly, Donald, I, I don't know how to advise you in this situation now. Oh, I love her. I love her so much. I truly love Benita. Not just her. She now has a beautiful daughter for me. I still love her. I love her more than any other woman.
Amor. come to find that nothing but the truth from you. What truth, mother? About your daughter. I want to know who that girl's real father is. I want nothing but the truth now. He's getting married in two weeks' time. Why is he not getting married to you? After you have a child for him. contact. How come you know about his forthcoming wedding? I, I only got to know a few days when I got into the city. He still loves me. But I don't want to interrupt his wedding. Don't be stupid. Whether it feels good or not, you must stop that wedding immediately. Yes. You have a child for him. I want to know who that idiot is. That wedding must not hold. Don must be joking. How can he be talking of loving Benita when his wedding to Liz is just a few days to go? I want that girl. I just can't watch him take both sisters to himself. I must be fast to expose the secrets I have been keeping from everyone. But how do I tell him of my love for Benita? How do I even stand before General Dennison to make this confession? to this place. I just want to be left alone. I'm sorry I've not told you this. What? I've been flirting with someone online. Please just leave. Baby, please, I'm I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Have ample hotel reservations for them at Megados. Oh, Why don't you go out and find Pavel? At least for the period of the wedding. To avoid. 
creating any wrong impression on Donald's family. The only impression a military general is known for is discipline. Please, why don't you do this for me as a special wedding gift? I already have your special wedding gift prepared and aligned. It's too late. Meanwhile, the drinks I ordered from the Netherlands have arrived. Go and pick them up. Yes, Dad. Donald has taken care of that already. Good. Thank you for being a disciplined daughter. Let me go. Okay, Dad, but Dad, please think about what I told you, please. Leave me. She must have bought that pregnancy. Are you trying to play a fast one on me? No, how, how can I? How can I play a fast one to the woman I love? I have prayed for so many years to see you once again, and now you're here. Benny, you won't understand. You don't understand. I love you. I love you with all my heart, and I'll do anything and everything to prove that to you. See that, that night, you, you remember that night, that, that night I took your virginity away from you, that same night, you equally took my heart away from me. Enough, enough, don't go there, don't you dare go there, listen, all I am saying is that you cannot marry my blood sister. I already have a child for you. She must get rid of that pregnancy before it becomes too late. And I am working on it. And I hope you are still working on making sure that wedding does not hold. I'm still working on that as well. Okay. Trust me still. I, I can't do anything for your love. I, I, I love you. I truly love you and I'll do anything and everything to make you happy.
house is still looking okay. Uh, we just need to touch up on the paint. Grass and cuts, edges. Nothing elaborate. Do we necessarily have to do Just a few paintings. Just to paint the house. Uh, take care of the lawn, keep it low, then the hedges. That's all. Nothing elaborate. We necessarily have to paint the whole place. We need to do that, you know. Everything has to be bright and beautiful. Okay. For the wedding. Lizzie said she already had an event decorator that will make the place beautiful. I see. Yes. Uh, <laughs> Come back. What did you just say? What did you just call me, Dad? I'm sorry, Dad. I God damn it! You don't use that word on me again. I don't want to hear it. Is that clear? Is that clear? Do I make myself clear? Now, look at it. Look at what you just did. You walked on this lawn. Do you know what this lawn is? You know what this is? This is a lawn. It is called what? A lawn. A lawn. It costs money. It takes money to keep it the way it is. You don't pass. You don't walk on it. You pass through here. But now you are you are using your dirty, slimy leg. Dirty millipede legs on my lawn. You don't do that. He does that leg. You know, you know what? You shameless idiot. Listen, listen. All you brought to me is shame. Shame, that's what you brought. Every time I look at you, you know what I see? You know what I see? Oh, I see an animal. I see a cow. I look at you, I see a dog. That's what I see. Okay? Shameless brat that your sister, your younger sister, is having her wedding in a few days' time. And that's a thing of joy. I'm happy. We're all happy. In fact, even people outside here are happy. Yes, that's a thing of pride. Now, but what do you bring to the table? What are you bringing home to me? All you're presenting to me is what? Bastard. Slimy bastard, that's what you are coming home with, and you're here calling me that. Don't, don't ever do that. Is that clear? Um, uh, honey, she told me that the so called man will be having his wedding in a few days' time, that he still loves her. That's what she told me. So, you believe the pack of lies, the heap of lies coming from, from this shameless brat. What do you expect? Now, didn't she tell us that she didn't know the whereabouts of the man? Didn't she do that? Yeah? I have found him. What? What did you just say? I have found him. You found the idiot. You found him. Now listen, that wedding will not hold, okay? You go get prepared and take me immediately to that man without any further delay. Is that clear? Is that clear? Move, run, come on! Connie, we are not done with it. Now listen, what are you not done with? What are you not done with? You didn't hear what I said? Do you know what this means? A general, you don't call a general back when he already has his Mind his attention fixated on a military strategy. You don't do that, okay? I'm sorry, sir. I'm sorry. Do I need to repeat myself? No, no, sir. You don't do it, okay? Military strategy, once he moves, he moves. Don't call me back again. Now go, 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 come on. Move. What did you just say? I need a powerful abortion pill. What for? I want to get rid of Lizzie's pregnancy immediately. Like right now. Why? Because I want to go for the woman I truly love. Donut. I thought you said the pregnancy is five months old. So it will be dangerous to risk an abortion here. And it will be more dangerous 
for her to give birth to that child. Is, is that your final that decision? That is my final decision. Doctor Donatus, my friend. And so far, everything is set for the wedding. Okay. Um, but the, for the media company, they demanded 100% pay on or before the wedding day. I thought my fiancé already took care of that. Yes, ma, but he paid them 70% upfront fee. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, right on time. He's back. Don't worry, before you leave, you get a check for that, okay? Okay. Uh, manager, I go fully set for my wedding. Yes, sir. Good day. All is certainly well, sir. Okay. <laughs> I'm honey, she'll be needing the balance. Oh, okay, yes. Um, the manager called me. Right, he called me today. Maybe don't tell him to get my check. So, I'll give you a leave that you give to him, okay? Ah! 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 when you made the confession. He said that is not what he wants to hear. <laughs> but is that not the only thing you have done wrong? That is the only one he's likely to know. No. No. A good man like Donatus appreciates it when his woman tells him the bitter truth. If there is any other thing you're keeping away from him, apart from the ones you've told him, please go back to him and confess. What are you doing here? Darling, you you are my sunshine. Okay. You're my biggest dream. Go tell your father that I am the father of your child. I am ready to go through lake of fire all just to make you my wife. Please, Ben, I love you. It's already too late. I have found the biological father of my daughter. Is this... Please, Ben, don't do what you're about to do is murder. Please, my heart is fading away. Please. I love you, Ben. I love you. Can you hear yourself talk? Tell me, what shall it profit me after waiting for eight years for the biological father of my daughter? Only to dump it for his best friend? No, no, no. He is getting married to your sister in a few days' time. Mm. And your sister is five months pregnant. Please, save that for the Beds.
Oh, my legs, my legs. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Oh, sorry, sorry. Take it easy now. Sorry, sorry. 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 Oh, sorry. Calm down. Easy. Uh, you don't easy. tell me to calm down. Is it hot? Easy. Oh. Easy, easy. I know it's painful. It's easy. Sorry, sorry. Oh shit, sorry. Sorry, sorry. Yeah. Easy, easy, easy. Yeah. I'm trying. Easy. Easy. Oh god. Easy. Rest in peace, rest in peace. Rest in peace. Let's go. Let's go. Try. Easy. Let's go. Let's go. Yeah. One more. One more. Sorry. Sorry. Ah. Yeah. Sorry. Confess, yeah, baby. I'll confess, baby. I'll confess. Baby. Okay, I, I will confess. Yes, I will confess. I have, I have two plots of land in this town. I have a house that I rented out to tenants. My director bought me an SUV because he's been asking me out for the past two years. But I sold the car and deposited the money in, my, in a private account that you don't know of. <laughs> Baby, I'm not trying to make it a secret, okay? I'm only waiting for our wedding night to tell you everything as a surprise. <laughs> I love you so much. I don't know what came over me. I'm sorry. Is wrong somewhere. Yes, something is wrong somewhere. Yeah. La. Hey. Uncle, good morning, sir. Uh, good morning. Uncle, Uncle Sanusi, please, where is my mommy? Your mommy? Yes. Ah, I guess yeah, that is not the important question. You see, this is your question. It's not important at all. The relevant question is, where is your daddy? My, my mommy said my daddy is coming soon. Your daddy is coming soon? Yes. Correct. You see, now you are talking. Uh, your, your mommy ko, is also coming soon. But for your daddy, uh, uh, your name is not sorry. Your name is not sorry. Oh. Lie. <laughs> ah. Come on for you. No? Do very well. La ila. I said, come out. You know they hear me? I go slapping me over like. listen to yourself you said retired isn't it time you kept your military rank at bay 
it's, it's causing a lot of confusion in the house. Woman, get off my military repertoire. It is center rank to you. Let me see the doctor now. Come on. Okay, sir. All right. Sir. Right away. So how did it go? Perfect. The doctor confirmed that she has lost the pregnancy. Good. So one hurdle crossed. What next? The wedding. Yes. The wedding has to be cancelled. That one. I mean, who's going to talk about a wedding? And that's my condition. The wedding is cancelled and forgotten. Okay. If you say so. Yeah. I'm afraid. Oh, what? I'm afraid. I, she might find out that you are the one that did it. I always know what to tell her. Hmm. I know how to go about the whole thing. For real? Mm -hmm. Okay. Go on. Tell me about it. I'm listening. I am going to tell you that after the shake break. <laughs> It's almost uh, four days to our daughter's wedding. Meanwhile, Donald is yet to be on his feet. This is getting me worried. Honey, I'm even more worried myself. How will this wedding hold him with him in that condition? What will I guess say? Her first daughter is a baby mama to an unknown man. And her second daughter is getting married to a man that is almost a cripple. I'm in the most confused state now. Wedding is the last thing on the mind of someone with such pains. So, uh, are you suggesting the wedding should be cancelled? What else are all these things pointing to? Postponement. Within two days' time, his condition resists. And we have no option but to postpone the wedding. I am going to help you. That's on condition that you tell me the truth. You say the man that got you pregnant is getting married soon. Yes, sir. In a few days' time, sir. How do you know he still loves you? Proposed to the woman he wants to marry because we both lost contact for a very long time. And when I saw him some few days back, he offered to cancel the wedding. But I refused. What manner of rubbish is this? Is he still willing to cancel the wedding? Yes, sir. He called me this morning and was begging me to consider his hand in marriage. Good. Good. Now listen, you will call him now in our presence. Mm. Ask him to go ahead with the cancellation of the wedding. That you are still interested. Do I make myself clear? Do I? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. But, sir, the, the bride-to-be is a woman like me. You need to be already have a child for this man. So that answers the question. Here, take it. Take it. Dial the number. 
I'm sure you know it off head. get to find out she took abortion pills. Look, Donald, I am the private doctor to this family. And I owe that family nothing but the truth. Donatus, I thought we are in this together. Oh, yes. We used to be until you started up the competition. Competition? What competition are you talking about? What competition? Benita is the only woman I have ever loved all my life. So it is either her or nobody else. in the house. Please turn out. Sanusi! Sanusi! Where's everybody? Where's turn out? Sanusi, are you deaf? Am I speaking to stones? Where are my parents? Sanusi! Where is he? He. Uh, who? Where's Donna? Your one. fiance. He's the one I'm looking for. He disappeared from the house and we thought he came to visit you at the hospital. Only for us to get there and we didn't see both of you. Have you searched in his room whether he is back? I've searched virtually everywhere, but he's nowhere to be found. Could he have gone to in this condition? Where? Something must have happened somewhere. I know why he's running. He drugged me so as to abort my pregnancy. He was afraid of your rot, Dad. What sort of a heartless general are you? A general that is supposed to be a protection to his own family? But yours is a cause to us, Dad. Why? Why, Dad? Why?
one more word from you. Camp in hell. Please, please hold on. Speak. Just a word. You will be dead. Abigail. Abigail, are you okay? Have you tried finding out if he has another woman in his life? Donatus is not a womanizer, so that is not the problem. Every man is subject to change. I have tried him several in the past with the most beautiful girls in the world. But guess what? He did not fall. So that is not the problem. <gasps> then, maybe he set a trap for you, which you failed. If not, why will he change so much? But I've confessed virtually everything I did wrong. But he keeps saying that is not what he wants to hear. Abigail, think. Think deep. There must be something. You can't lose a relationship of five years because of one stupid secret. Yes, sir. You said you are presenting the man that got you pregnant to us tomorrow. Is he still holding? Yes, sir. Is he coming to take his baby or he's coming to do the right thing? He's coming to seek for my hand in marriage, sir. Good. Good. You know what? Make tomorrow your day of victory. Is that right? Yes, sir. That correct? Yes, sir. Okay. Carry on. Clean. in life. Look, never you trust anyone, not even your own blood sister. <laughs> you 
Anyways, my father is to be blamed for all this. Look, darling, your father only meant well for his family. Eh, uh, Benny, how are you feeling? Doctor, hope my sister is responding to treatment. What do you expect? Benny is bringing her husband home today. Interesting. Have you seen him before? Benny, I'm here for the makeup. Shall we? Okay, I'll do that once the doctor leaves. No, we have to do it now. We don't have time, remember? Okay. <laughs> uh, okay. Um, congratulations. Thank you. Um, baby, do you like this color? Um, let me see. Mm. Beautiful. Mm. <laughs> she will like it. Oh, here you are, darling. Uh, I was just coming from your room. I'm here. Yeah, mom. You know, since today is a special day, I asked her to come to my room so I could make her look more beautiful. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Continue, continue. I'm learning. <laughs> <laughs> mom, you know, I'm so, so happy for Benny. Mm. At last, God is finally wiping away her tears. Sweet sister, congratulations once more. Lizzie, thank you. Your day shall come soon. <laughs> and we we'll all celebrate with you. Amen. 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 Always wishing me the best. <sighs> happy is an understatement. To explain the way I feel today. At last, my adorable granddaughter will set her eyes on her father today. So, honey, how do you feel? I feel great, Grandma. Good. <laughs> That's nice. I'll forgive my father when he comes today. Oh, sorry, darling. Baby. It's okay, darling. It's okay. <laughs> Benny, it's okay. Daddy loves you so much. Okay? It's okay, darling. <laughs> <laughs> Donald! 
was this? Donald? Donald? Sir, I... Yes, just forgive me, okay? Forgive me, sir. I'm very sorry. This is infratic. Hi. This is infratic, Nitatum. Somebody... Somebody should be caught marshaled. Somebody should be caught marshaled! And you have the guts to say this to a general! You have the guts! What's this? What's this? I no see! Where is my gun? Where's my gun? Hey, Guang! Yes, my gun! Okay, inside the motor, inside car! No! What do you mean? Where is my gun? Oh, well, lie, the lie, Oga. When I wash motor finish, when I finish motor finish, it's inside the car now. Nah. What are you talking about, Sanusi? Lie, lie. Yes. Give me your gun. No, all correct, Oga. Topia. Topia. What is it? Where is it? All correct, Oga. Well, lie, Oga. I never see my gun. What are you talking about? Well, lie, there's a canina de Allah, Oga. I never see my gun. Sanusi. Yeah, Oga. Sanusi. Yeah. I will kill somebody now. I will kill somebody now. I will kill somebody, Sanusi. Sorry, Oga. I will kill. Sorry, Oga. I will bring down somebody now. I will exterminate somebody now. Sanusi. Why, 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 Enemy action. Yeah, what, 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 what did I say? Enemy action. Yeah, what, 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 can you disarm the general? Can you disarm the general? Ah, 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 ah. Neva, Neva, Oga. Yes, Oga. Say it. Can't disarm the general. Hey, Tuftabia. Can not disarm the generals? Say, hey. Can not disarm the generals? No. Can not disarm the generals? Sanusi! Yes, Oga! Shut up! Awkward, Oga! Move! Move! Sanusi! Gate! Young man, the Lord has a word for you. The Lord said you are a doctor. There is a cause upon your head. Until this cause is broken, you will never have a child. And the Lord says you know what I'm talking about. But you went seeking for love. Where are you supposed to ask for mercy? That is the message from the Lord. Uh, man of God, I, I know who you are talking about. Look, I, I am supposed to ask for her forgiveness. But you see, I love her. I think my marriage to her will make her forgive me. Go now and confess to her for her forgiveness. Asking for a hand in marriage is not important for now. May the blessings of the Lord be with you. I need to know where this man is coming from. Stay back. Stay back. Jenny, this is, 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 this is
Lizzie, please. Lizzie, please. Please. Don't come any closer. Lizzie, please. Lizzie, please. Just, 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 let, just, just let that little girl go, please. If you do, I will murder this bastard in cold blood. Lizzie, please. Please, let go of the innocent child, please. I swear with my life. If you come closer, I will murder this bastard and make sure one of you joins her before I kill myself. Uh, okay, Lizzie, say. I'm sorry, I know you're really hot, okay? I know you're hot. Listen, I never knew, I never knew that someone was pregnant for me. I never knew that she was pregnant for me before I, 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 I proposed to you. I mean, your sister. I, I, I never knew. It, 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 it would be an abomination for me to go ahead and marry you. Please, let's just settle this amicably, peacefully. Did you just say peacefully? Yeah, there is yeah. nothing, nothing to settle peacefully. Because this abomination you're talking about, sweetheart, has begun already. And you must finish what you started. Mommy, you can't stop her. Please. We can settle this without hurting anyone. Oh, really? I beg you. Oh, really? You're talking about harm? Do you know the harm you've caused me? Do you know the emotional trauma you put me through and you're here talking? Just shut up! Mommy. Because I'll kill this bastard. I will kill her. No, no, you Please. can't do that. Please just let the girl out of this. Can you just, just let that little girl out of it? Just let her out of this. Please let her out of it. I swear, if you come closer, you will see the demon inside. Mommy. Say you see? I'm on the case. Go. Don't open the gate. Don't open the gate. Don't open the gate. two weeks ago, I ran into my ex-boyfriend. I tried everything humanly possible to avoid him. But, but he, he drugged me and raped me. I'm not sorry for not telling you all this. Why? Look at you. So you go about messing your life up. You think I will find out someday? Okay. I'm disappointed in you. So ashamed of you. Maybe I... I... You have every right to be angry at me, but I'm sorry. It will never happen again. I want him never to call my number again. No, no, no. Go on. They are about to tell me. No, go on, go on, go on. Tell me, tell me. There are more. Tell me. No, baby. That's all. I'm no, sorry. Let me warn you. If you don't get out of here in this minute, I'll crush you. Just tell me where the child is, okay? I, I, I will make things easy for you. Tell me where she is now. Please. Tell me where the child is. Okay? Why don't you talk to me? Tell me where the child is. Lizzie! Lizzie, where is my dog? Please, where, where, where I said, is where is my daughter? Just calm down. I am talking to you. Where is my child? Don't tell me to calm down. She should provide my daughter. Where is my child? The war you have started is a battle to finish. Oh, well, uh, Mother, did you hear her? Just, 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 what? Did you hear her? Please. Um, it's not what you think, okay? Please, please. Lizzie, I never knew I had a child back home. Not until I saw her, and this is the second time I'm seeing her. I'm sorry. 
Oh, really? Yeah. And you couldn't respect me and open up to me? Instead, you drugged me to have got the pregnancy I so much cherished. Yes, but I'm, I'm sorry. It, it, it was a coincidence, okay? It was. You, you don't expect, I mean, two sisters, both of you, having kids for me? It doesn't make sense. Oh, sweetheart, that is why the bastard child has to be sacrificed to our love to be. My no. daughter is not a bastard. And if you dare harm her, no, leave me alone. If you dare harm her, our leave is, me alone. Our daughter is Mama, not, talk to her. Our daughter is talk not. Talk to her. Our daughter is not a bastard, okay? Nothing will happen. Nothing. Mother, well, please. Just take it easy. The war has just begun. And if you cross my path, if you dare cross my path, Oh, what's with you two? I bet you don't want to see my madness. Because if you dare me, I would spit on oh, your Oh, shut up! Shut up! You're an empty vessel, and there is nothing you can do. Nothing! Can, no, no, can you not just keep quiet? No, 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 I will deal with you! Shut up! Stop to her! Stop to her! You can do nothing! Stop to her! I will deal with you. I will deal with you. Tell her to bring my child. I will tell her. Tell her to bring my child. My sister, do I want to deal with you? This is my daughter. She has to bring my daughter. Donald, why? Why have you chosen to become a terrible son in law to my family? I am disappointed in you. I'm sorry, man. I, I never intended to be a problem to your house, I, I, to your home, to, to, to your family. Never intended that. It's, it's just, just, just a terrible coincidence. Please just forgive me. Just look for a place in your heart to forgive me. Just, just forgive me. That's all I'm asking. Did you just say forgive you? Yes, ma'am. Just forgive. Did I hear you say that? Yes. Donald, you are into my two daughters. And you sit here and ask me to forgive you? How can I explain this? How do I explain this? Your case is even worse. Don't why me? Why me? Really don't why? How, 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 did I, how did I get here? I mean, why am I in the center of all these atrocities? How? Why? God, please. I wish I could recover from this. My heart so deep. Please. My only two daughters. You've turned into devil's property. Donald, you've turned them against their family. Against their dreams. And you've turned them against themselves. I, 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 I didn't mean to. Or be ready to land yourself behind bars. This is a very clear situation. Lizzie, a man cannot marry you when your blood sister already has a child for him. Though the whole thing is terrible, but at the same time is understandable. You must both learn to bury your hatchets and move on. No way! No way! This bitch has to provide my child! What has the innocent get got to do with this case? What? Will you shut up and allow me to finish the reading? What is wrong with you? No, mom. Leave her. Let her rant. Go ahead and blab. Madam Noisemaker. Go ahead and blab. Will you no, shut up? No, 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 no. Let me see how your rantings will bring out your, your, your bastard child from where I'm hiding her. Enough of this nonsense. It is you that is a mad woman. It is you that is a mad woman. How dare you seize my child? Will you shut up? Look at this thing. Keep talking. I'm Keep really blabbing. Sure. Keep blabbing. Let me see how you see that girl again. I will deal with you if you don't bring back my child. Mother, she has to bring back my child. Keep blabbing. Let me see how you see that girl again. That little brat, that thing you brought into this house. After how many years to steal my man, you hop. Shall you tell me I will kill you? I will kill you. 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 I said enough of this nonsense. What is wrong with both of you? Will you keep quiet? 
even if you don't have respect for me, you should have respect for this letter coming from the commission of police. That's true, that's true. Rubbish. Lizzie, you must release that child now or it will amount to a kidnap. Tell her, you don't have to be told the penalty of committing such acts. Oh yeah? That is what the letter says. Here it is. Mom, I am five months pregnant for Donald. I will only release your little brat after when my child is born on hers. They connived aborting my pregnancy. But fortunately for me, their evil plans failed. Do not let this abomination get stands. Do not. I mean, what are they going to say? What is the world out there going to say? That two sisters are getting married to one man? What I'm trying to teach us is save the situation. The shame. The shame that is about to come to this house. That's exactly what I'm trying to save. Sister. I shouldn't have challenged you in the first place. I'm sorry. I mean, I know how it hurts to suddenly realize this bad news only has to your wedding. Forgive me. Oh, please don't bloody call me your sister, you shit devil. Do I look like a dog to you? Oh. Oh, I see why you came back after eight years. Just to destroy your relationship, I sacrificed everything to build. In case you suffer from low memory, let me remind you that the battle line has been drawn and there is no going back. It's either you fall aside or I go down. Um, there's a place, okay? Please, do not give the devil a chance. Do not. If not for anything, for the sake of your beloved parents, I beg you, please let peace reign. Oh, please, just hold it right there. I don't really get what you're asking me to do. To forgo the man I truly love and carry his child? Or about the same pregnancy that this prostitute right here is taking a chance of? She already has a grown-up child. Uh, Lizzie, she already has a grown-up child. And yours are still unborn. Oh, that is why I asked you all to hold on until my baby here is born. The baby you put in my womb. I, 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 I know, but you just have to calm down, okay? You just have to calm down. I mean, all this, all this shit. You know what, you know what, you know what, you know what? Just save your breath. Save it. Because he's just wasting your time, pleading and begging and all that shit. There, there, there is nothing to reason with, you get? You know, and for your stupid so-called marriage, you can go to blazes for all I care. And as for my precious beloved child here, he's going to be with me forever. I hope you have succeeded in carrying out what the Lord gave to you. How you succeeded? Man of God, the problem here is 
the lady is my best friend's wife. So I, I, I don't know how I can open up that, that confession to her. If I do, I will destroy their marriage. Man of God, please. Let's look for another way to go about this. Please, hearken to this instruction of the Lord and relieve yourself out of this affliction. If you are afraid of letting a husband to know about it, then why can't you go to her personally? Or rather, go through another member of her family. Oh, no, 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 man of God. You, you still don't understand. If I go through her family or her parents, that would make the situation worse. It will wash it off. Your house is on fire and you are busy chasing rat. If you are ready to relieve yourself of, out of uh, this affliction, then use your wisdom and do the will of God. Confess to her. All this will be gone. Okay? Just take it easy. Okay? Take it easy. The Lord will see you. Please, sir. I, 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 I am sorry. I, I, I don't know how to make this confession in the presence of my friend here. Help me beg your daughter to forgive me. I am a changed person now. So, after all you did to my daughter, you have the guts to stay in front of me and talk about the forgiveness or, or confession. The, the Lord has directed me to her and also to ask for her, for her forgiveness. I regret all my actions for <laughs> these years. Please have mercy on me. You were nothing but a beast. How could you? How could you do that to such an innocent girl who ran to you for protection? How could you? Because he said you were he's a dog. A dog. Yes. I, I was led by the devil. The devil indeed. <laughs> I am sorry. I regret my action all these years, please, ma. Forgive me. I am dying away. Don't let that make my life be wasted away. Please forgive me. I shall not forgive you. The more I look at you, the more I look at you, the more I, I want to squeeze, and squeeze the life, squeeze life out of you. You know what? You know what? You deserve to die!
ก็ชัดนี้เหี่ยว่าอยู่สมมุติท่านสมมติชอบสมมุติโอเคเบนนี่ please talk to me don't know Mom, I know that this family hasn't been at peace for a while now. Mom, you know I love you so much, and I'll do anything to make you happy. But your silence is killing me. Can someone please talk to me? Oh, talk to me, please. You're all looking moody. Oh my god, this calls for celebration a huge one. Baby, this is what we've been praying for. Oh my god, okay, baby, I promise to go get your angel right now. Okay, I love you all so much. Are you my father? Yes. Yes, yes, yes. And I am I am sorry for everything. What really happened between you and Donatus? It all happened the night after the birthday party. After I realized that Donatus has deflowered me while I was drunk, I had to run out of the house. On my way out, I met Donatus, who claimed to be a police officer. Stop, stop, stop! Where are you coming from at the time of the night? Someone raped me. Someone raped you? Yes. At this time of the night? I went to a birthday party and he drugged me and raped me. Okay, this is what we'll do. I am the vigilante in charge of this whole area. With me, you are safe this night. Just come there tomorrow, you take me to that idiot, okay? Move it! Move it!
So the DNA test you just saw confirmed that the donut is, is the biological father of my daughter Jenny. This is, I don't know what to say, but sister, I'm so sorry for everything that transpired between us. I'm sorry for the fighting, the argument, no, the no, kidnapping. No, 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 don't you say that. I should be the one to say sorry. It's all my fault. I mean, you're my sister. I should have found out the details before fighting over Donut. I'm doesn't sorry. Matter. It doesn't matter anymore. It's okay. I'm so happy we're back together. <laughs> <laughs> Sister, <Nana>. yeah. <laughs> you know we have a lot. Of